Well, today's, uh, what day is it? Wednesday. It's the 18th of October 2023 and we're back down in Palmanova in a slightly different place than we were yesterday. So yesterday we, were, we came as far as the beehive and then we had to have a drink and that's as far as we got. Well, today we're starting right in between uh, two hotels, very popular hotels here, the Santa Lucia and the San Matias Beach. And the beach behind us is the San Matias Beach. So that's where we're starting. So there's the uh, Santa Lucia. That's where Sean and Claire stayed this year and last year. And uh, this one is the San Matias Beach. That's where they're gonna be staying next year. Um, we were here recently, but uh, today we're with Angela, who arrived yesterday, and uh, I think she was a little bit exhausted. So, uh, hopefully getting back to normal now. And this is the, the beach, it's, uh, it's evening as well, so it's 10 to 7. It's been another really warm day, 26, 27, 28 maybe degrees today, but uh, tomorrow is the day when things begin to change and uh, we'll probably go down in temperature quite considerably is what the uh, newspapers are saying on Friday. Uh, in fact, the Mallorca Bulletin, used to be the Daily Bulletin, um, says temperatures to plummet. Uh, what they mean by plummet is it's going to go down about five degrees, four or five degrees. So where it might have been 28, it'll go down to 24, uh, but could go down as low as 21, 22. Uh, and that will be together with really strong winds on Friday. So uh, there is a, a weather warning, only a yellow warning at the moment for high winds and uh, considerable possibility of, um, of rain. This is a San Matias beach. Well, just having their dinners there now. What time is it? It's just five to seven in the evening, so the sun's beginning to go down. And uh, we're only going to have another couple of weeks of this, and then uh, we'll be getting, the hour will be changing, and so it will be going dark much earlier in the evening. So I guess we're going to we're gonna have to go work, walking earlier now. <laughs> and the temperatures will be gradually going down anyway, so it'll be more comfortable to walk out in the daytime. Where today at uh, two, three o'clock in the afternoon, it was actually very warm. I was um, doing granddad duties in Yokmay Or today. Went over there to pick the girls up from, from school, and they'd had some after school activities. And uh, so I picked them up and they were playing in the park and I just sat under a tree in the shade. This is CISOs, already getting busy. And it's not even seven o'clock, so that's really quite early for people to be dining out. It's really quite a, quite a strong breeze already. I did notice that in Yacht Mayor it was very breezy. And uh, we're not even anywhere near Friday yet. But it means it feels much more comfortable to walk. did notice there were people in the sea. There's still a few people even on the beach. Uh, there's no lifeguard though now. He does uh, finish his shift and then goes home. So there's no flag flying. Uh, there's no flag flying. That means there's no lifeguard on duty. And that means uh, be very careful if you're in the water. It looks very calm actually, considering there is a breeze. It is very calm. I did put an announcement up uh, today. Uh, I put it as a post in the in the YouTube channel, and I also put it onto the uh, Steve and Anita and Mielka Facebook uh, page. And uh, it's thinking ahead, thinking about Christmas. And 
an idea came to me that uh, it'd be nice to have your photographs on your videos and make a compilation of those uh, whatever you want to do really it can be just a, a picture or your favorite pick holiday snap which might have you in it or not have you in it already received uh, some already so i think i've got three so far uh, two photographs and uh, a video don't make the videos too long though well, I, if they are too long i'll just shorten them i'll uh, have to do a bit of editing otherwise the video will go on forever um, but anyway, my idea is to put them all together, making some sort of a slideshow which contains your pictures. So it'll be a little bit more unpredictable than, uh, than the regular video. And uh, Anita says she'll play a bit of Christmas music, so I'll get the piano out. And uh, she can play some songs for us. And then uh, I'll put them all together. I'm not sure when I'm going to do the cut-off date. It's got to be sometime in December. So there's plenty of time to get your photos to me. Best if you email them to me. So we've got a, an email address specially for this sort of thing. It's just Steve and Anita. Steve and Anita in Mallorca. All, no spaces, just one long word. Steve and Anita in Mallorca at gmail.com and if you send the photograph you need to let me know what it is who it is and, uh, and then uh, give me permission to use it yeah this has already met some friends hello are you angela yeah hi this is from knitting oh this is fun i used to work with anita oh it's nice to see lisa lisa part of anita's knitting group but also uh used to teach at the same school as both Anita and I, so Lisa was there at uh, BIS from many, many years ago when I was there. So yeah, Christmas just around the corner, photos, videos, if you want to do a special one, that's fine. Um, if you want to save it until December when you've got your Christmas decorations up and do one in front of the Christmas tree, either a photograph or a a little video just saying happy Christmas or whatever you want to say really um, I do reserve the right to include or not include depending on uh, <laughs> what the pictures look like um, and uh, so hopefully we'll get something nice at the end of it and I think so because there's a great bunch of people who watch these videos and uh, and they love uh, love Mallorca. It doesn't have to be Parmanova, but uh, I'm guessing there'll be quite a few from this sort of area. Um, actually, one I've already had is a lovely jacaranda tree um, in Soyer, or Puerto Soyer. I was watching a video, I think, from earlier on this year, and the, this was uh, only just being constructed, being built. So it's nice to see that it's actually finished. Hello and again. How are you? Good. It looks so nice here. Thank you very much. Are you going to stay open? I don't think we can. So this is uh, Calvia Beach House, uh, Saver by the Sea. And well, we're going to have a little walk uh, to the end of here or a little bit further and uh, and then we're going to come back we're going to try it out we've never been there so uh, it's a really nice looking place so it'd be nice to give them a little bit of uh, custom and then we can uh, let, show you what it's about let you know what you're missing put it on your list of places to go hopefully for next year So we did have a big storm the other day and the water will have, the rain will have come down here, washed down and um, we lost a bit of beach by the looks of things. This happens frequently at this time of year. Uh, you can see the rain must have come whooshing around here, the floods and uh, well there's the beach being washed away. It's not unusual, it's something that happens 
quite regularly. Do you want to walk further or have you had enough? It gets a bit bouncy along here. But it's just a nice view, so that's why I like to come along here. You can see that it is quite windy, but very calm. The seat is very, very calm. I've seen pictures of uh, quite rough sea in different parts of the island. So it depends which way the wind's blowing. And uh, obviously we're a little bit sheltered on this side at the moment. That's the Fergus Tobago there. You can just come down these steps and you're down here. going to be open in April 2024. It's really early to close. This one, I'm not sure whether this one's closed. It's actually their opening hours. They've closed already. Oh, we've got La Vista and we've got the Scotsman, Scotsman and then JJ Sports. possibly want. How's that? Have you done enough now? Do you want to walk back? He's a chef. Lisa's husband is. Lisa's husband is a chef. Well, it's getting very windy and uh, we're getting a little bit peckish, so we're going to wind this video up here. But we are actually going to go for some tapas or something to eat. We'll wait and see when we get there. So thanks very much for watching this. And uh, if I've got anything interesting, I'll tag it on the end. So see you in the next one. Bye. 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 Bye.